And let me say this, Congressman Kyers to me, to me, is still one of the greatest people I have ever known. But because I think this is one of the greatest countries, I must now separate personal feelings for my country. And I recognize now, if we don't stand up now for humanity, we as humans will lose everything. Yep. Yes. And so yep. we don't impeach this president now. No. Yeah. No. Not only will we lose this country, but we'll lose the world. Yes. Yes. Amen. Yes. Amen. Yes. Now. So, now. Now. So today, the time is now. So today, I know many of you have come. But this was not easy, no. because Congressman Conyers and the Commissioner Black Caucus has always been for me the conscience of the Congress. That's right. But today, the people must be the conscience for the right. Congress. Yeah. Now rise up. The people must now speak up. The people must now make themselves heard. <coughs> I tell you all, do not give up hope. No. Do not lose heart. And also, unlike my mom in the movement, I understand, I do understand how hard this is for Congressman Conyers. Not as hard as it was for oh, Barry, my son. And as Cindy said, not as hard. I do understand. What I also understand is that as of right now, there are 3,633 soldiers who all vote for impeachment. Yeah. There are 600,000 Iraqis who, if they were citizens, they would say impeachment. And so now for those 3,000 633 soldiers, one name, Casey Shin. The people have no choice. We take back our house, we take back our government, and it's time to have power to the people. 